I, I think the biggest danger any country faces, and particularly the United States, is uh, if you're in a lead position, you tend to take your leadership for granted. And if one looks back in history, uh, in the 16th century, Spain was a leader, in the 17th century, it was France, and the 19th century, it was Great Britain, the 20th century, it was the U.S. Warren Buffett says in the 21st century, it'll be China. And uh, Warren is somebody to pay attention to, in my opinion. Uh, at the same time, uh, America is in a reasonably good position uh, as of this moment, even though we don't feel it uh, with the current turmoil in the markets. Uh, we uh, still represent uh, over 20 percent of the world's d domestic product uh, or global product, and we're about 5 percent of the world's people. Uh, we have great universities. Uh, we have uh, overwhelming uh, financial resources compared with uh, any other country and uh, most any groups of countries, in fact. Uh, the challenge I think we face is that uh, you can't take leadership for granted. Other countries have done that and lost leadership. Uh, another challenge we face is that uh, uh, change happens very quickly uh, in this world. And one has to uh, uh, run very quickly in order to uh, stay where you were before. There are a lot of aspects to uh, global leadership. Uh, there's financial leadership, there's scientific leadership, uh, cultural leadership, ethical leadership, uh, uh, business leadership, military leadership, and uh, we're living off the seed corn of our investments in the past, and we are not reinvesting today in the fashion in which we should be. And my prediction is that if we don't change, we will lose our leadership uh, in many areas. Uh, the first one we'll lose will be in this competitiveness for jobs. And uh, when that happens, the standard of living drops. Uh, you have less money for national security. And uh, I might say this is not just my own view. I, I had the privilege of working uh, with a group of 20 people, uh, presidents of universities, CEOs of corporations, uh, former government officials, uh, a couple of Nobel Prize winners. We devoted considerable time to this question of competitiveness. and. Uh, I think the views I'm expressing here would probably be the unanimous views of that group, even though I don't speak for them, uh, I, th I think that's the case.